Yeah, I mean, I think what I didn't like about speaking at Jackson State is because the way that it was marketed was right. that I was a cautionary tale. Hey. Oh. That's okay. not what, if you were to play back the whole footage, what am I warning you guys about? When I, I didn't like that it made it seem like I'm coming in there and I'm telling you guys, hey, don't get got. That's not what happened. Okay. Because if I was a gold digger, I would be easily the dumbest one. I'd be the least successful one. Like I am not in a position to tell young men about gold diggers or what women do. Or Brittany Renner was recently on Shannon Sharp's podcast for an interview. It was a pretty entertaining interview overall, but Brittany was all over the place as usual. One of the things that she brought up was the speech she was asked to do at Jackson State. She slammed Coach Prime and claims that she didn't realize she would be speaking about how she lures young athletes into relationships with her. From the perspective of Coach Prime, he wanted her to talk to the young athletes and let them know that a lot of women will be chasing them because they are football players and they may have pro careers in the future. As much as Brittany may not want to admit it, she is a cautionary tale for not only athletes, but all successful men that can be taken advantage of by women that see them as a meal ticket. Brittany is well known for being a social media star that uses her looks in order to trap men. Coach Prime wanted her to let the student athletes know how women like her could take advantage of them and manipulate them for their own personal gain. However, Brittany claims that she didn't think this was the reason she was invited and claims that she doesn't intentionally trap men. Most recently, Brittany had a baby with PJ Washington and they have had a very messy situation because Washington has been asked to pay a large amount of child support and didn't feel like he could see his son enough. This relationship was also controversial because PJ Washington was very young when he started dating Brittany. Though Brittany likes to act naive, she dated PJ Washington when he was a freshman in college at Kentucky and she was a grown woman. As a grown adult, I don't understand why someone in their right mind would be on a college campus trying to date a man that lives in a dorm room. This is a situation that has happened to many athletes because as soon as they step on campus, they become a target for women that want to raise their babies and never have to work again in their lives. Seeing athletes getting into committed relationships at 18 makes me shake my head because it's obvious that these women are looking to cash a check when the young men get drafted. As much as Brittany doesn't want to admit it, she threw away her soccer career to drop out and date the quarterback of her college's football team after he got drafted. But I will save that topic for another video. She has a lot of internal things that she needs to work on because it appears that she has potential, but she hasn't always made the right decisions in life. Let me know what you think in the comment section and be sure to like and subscribe for more college football and basketball content.